Hi, and I'm gonna show you how do I make the model. So first, I would like you to represent some of these three spears. They have uh, actually uh, the same size of spears, but they have uh, different geometries. I'm gonna explain you what vertices I'm gonna adjust or what uh, edges uh, I'm gonna adjust, something like that, or polygons as well. If you're gonna make 3D objects, you should, uh, which shapes are you gonna make into the 3D, and especially geometry. So first, I'm gonna show you some of these basic three spears and uh, polygons. Let's take a look at this spear, uh, which is have uh, less geometry. And let me turn on some of these vertices. And the vertices, I can actually control in this model. But it has a different adjustments of the which polygons are made of. So uh, let's take a look at uh, the second spear, which is uh, actually have a little bit uh, more uh, polygons. And when I turn on the vertices, it kind of looks uh, different than the last time. Not just the vertices, and the edges too. As you can see, I have to the model and figure out how to get the mathematics is gonna work. And I'm gonna show you of today of this last spear that has a high quality of the geometries. And the last of the vertices, it has a, a little bit more adjustments, but it has a lot of polygons. All right, so uh, I would like to represent this character from the Droidinator, and he is a hero from the film. I'm gonna show you how many polygons for this character has, and how many numbers of mesh. I can show you throughout this character, and I'm gonna turn on the wireframe. As you can see, it has a spear. This spear is actually have 25 segments and 2.0 radius, but this one is a single mesh. As you can see, most of them have uh, 25 segments and the arms, uh, let me say, in about uh, 15 segments. But this character of the number of polygons are in about 3,705. So basically, it's kind of a lot. So let's turn on how many mesh in this character, and I can turn on the bounding box. Okay, so this is in about 15 mesh. As you can see, this character, it creates a lot of more geometry details and what's going on in mud box. We haven't even mentioned yet so far is what texture is actually matched with this model. It is also, it creates a lot of more subdivision surfaces. And thanks for this feature in this character.